644 hectares in 24 hours. That is the current tillage record. With our John Deere 9RX 640 and a Bednar disc with a working width of 18.4 meters, we want to try to beat this number. But is the 9RX 640 up to the challenge? Our location is Romania, near Bucharest, one of the biggest markets for agricultural products. Heavy and dry soil, temperatures above 40 degrees during the day and just under 10 degrees at night make for a perfect location to test the 9RX 640 to its limits. I'm feeling really positive, so the preparation is going really well. So we are in the last steps to get everything done. I'm excited when we start the 24 hours here in the field in the center of Romania. I'm a farmer and I want to try these kind of machines, like the Jundir tractor and the Bednardis, to the limit. 3 p.m., the starting signal for our challenge. From now on, it's all about full concentration for 24 hours. The first hundreds of hectares are going smoothly. The high drawbar power of the 9RX is helping the team to work through the demanding soil. The soil that we are working, it's a hard soil. That's why we need solid implements. The temperature has already hit 35 degrees. The extreme heat is not only a challenge for the 9RX 640, but also for the drivers and the whole team. At one point, the team has to clear the Bednar disk of straw and dry soil. In this region of Romania, the average rainfall is only 450 to 600 millimeters per year. Will these extreme conditions throw a wrench in our plans to set a new record? During the whole time, the on-site John Deere team monitors the performance and location of the 9RX 640 through the John Deere Operations Center and remote display access. The working depths have been between 4 to 10 centimetres throughout the whole record trial. That's why it's important to have a powerful machine. With its 640 horsepower, the 9RX has phenomenal performance. 9RX 640 is the perfect tractor here for this disc in point of power, in point of drawer power, in point of comfort. So far, everything's going according to plan. But how will the 9RX 640 perform during the evening and night? So we are now in the second field. It's already nine o'clock in the evening. That means we have already worked six hours here. We have done 200 hectares, and that means we are totally in time. And now let's see what the night will bring. Then, around 10.30, the team faces the first driver changeover. The visibility in the dark right now, you can see that it's very, very good. So we can see uh, very good the Bednar disc and uh, his behavior. Because we are running very fast in this moment at a depth of 6-7 centimeters. It's now late in the night. The drivers are able to see a full range of 360 degrees because the 9RX 640 comes with 24 LED surround lights. The tractor is very comfy and uh, we are running uh, very well. After uh, eight hours of uh, driving, we are watching closely what is happening. We can see that we have worked until now 300 hectares. So we are in schedule. The fuel tank is at 30% in this moment and we have a fuel consumption with an average of 3.1 liters per hectare, which is a very good one. In one hour we move the trailer uh, much more closer to the tractor because we don't want to stop uh, too much, maximum 7 minutes. Around 3 a.m. the 9RX 640 has to be refueled.
So we are prepared with the diesel and also with a small portion of AdBlue and of course with uh, two small uh, portions of coffee. <laughs> After the refueling and repeated tightening of the screws on the Bednar disc, the 9RX640 drives into the night, well prepared to tackle the remaining hectares. The night passes quickly and without problems. It's at the break of dawn, and there are still 200 hectares left before the current record is reached. The team has another nine hours left and is still confidently working. It's shortly after seven o'clock, so we are back from the night. We just changed the drivers. The night was a success. We are really good in time with a great team spirit. And we continue during the day now to get as most hectare as possible. Shortly after, the on-site team races to the tractor. A hydraulic tube on the Bednar disc needs to be repaired. All hands on deck to fix the problem as fast as possible. They're losing time. Is this 30-minute break going to cost them the record? Over the last 24 hours, a total of 769.4 hectares of land has been tilled. That's nearly 125 hectares more than the current record. And then, at exactly 3 p.m., the 9RX640 reaches the finish line. The challenge is over. I'm proud to stand now here in front of the 9RX640 and the Betna disc with 18.4 meters, and we fulfilled the 24 hours. We reached 769 hectares in 24 hours. I would say that's a great result and was a great and a fantastic team collaboration between Betna, Ipso and the John Deere team to fulfill our new test here with the 24 hours. Time to celebrate success.